DME Turbulent Flow Plastic Baffles for superior mold cooling performance. This test environment was created to show how coolant flows inside the water lines of a plastic injection mold. These drilled lines are critical for getting coolant to the molding surface to cool the parts prior to ejection. All three simulated coolant channels have been set up to have equal coolant pressure, identical hose fittings, and a 3 8 inch ID for the tubes. Each of these tubes is constructed of the same type of glass with the same internal dimensions. This is to ensure that all three simulated coolant channels are tested under the same conditions. Air was added to better view the coolant flowing in the coolant channels. The air was introduced at the coolant pump fitting for the purpose of this demonstration only. Notice how both brass baffles permit coolant blow-by, a condition where the coolant takes the shortest path of least resistance as it travels through the cooling channels. Coolant at the end of the brass baffles is stagnant and is not circulating through the cooling system. There is very little heat transfer occurring at the end of either brass baffle. Under the exact test conditions as the brass baffles, the turbulent flow plastic baffle provides significantly better coolant flow. In fact, the plastic baffle's patented side wipers force the coolant to flow all the way to the end of the baffle, up and over, bringing the coolant nearer to the molding surface just as coolant channels are intended to be used. As the coolant pressure for each of the three baffles is equally increased, the higher pressure appears to have little effect on the coolant flow with either brass baffle. Each of the brass baffles has a 20 thousandths clearance per side. The clearance on either side of the baffle blade is required to permit installation into the cooling channel as the baffle blade is turned into the threaded tap. This gap between the edges of the baffle blade and the gun drilled wall permit blow-by. The DME Turbulent Flow Baffle owes its superior performance to a molded-in wiper that runs the full length of the blade. The patented wiper creates a seal between the edge of the baffle blade and the wall of the cooling channel. These seals create two separate coolant chambers in the cooling channel, forcing the coolant to travel up and over the end of the blade. Another important feature of the Turbulent Flow Plastic Baffle is its raised ribs on both sides of the blade. This design promotes turbulent flow throughout the cooling channels. Turbulent flow ensures optimal cooling due to the coolant being circulated and directed back toward the center of the blade. Turbulent flow plastic baffles are constructed of a glass reinforced engineering thermoplastic called polythalamid. Polythalamid has a working temperature of 370 degrees for a constant 2000 hours of heat exposure. Polythalamid is commonly used in automotive radiators because of its ability to withstand the effects of glycol-based coolants under high temperature conditions. DME Turbulent Flow Plastic Baffles – Superior Mold Cooling Performance for Faster Cycle Times Available worldwide from DME Company, Turbulent Flow Plastic Baffles can be ordered online at www.dme.net. Contact DME today to improve the cooling performance of your molds.